The way you defeat terrorism is the same way you defeat malaria. As is well known, in malaria, you find the mosquitoes, right? You trace them back to the swamp where they breed, and then you station a platoon of sharpshooters around the swamp, and as the mosquitoes leave the swamp, you, you shoot them all, right? Back in the 70s, when, when I was an economic hitman, you know, we had a gap between rich and poor, but today it's twice as wide as it was then. Today, more than half the world's population lives on less than $2 a day. It's a slave wage, really, when you come right down to it in most of these places. The CIA was the, uh, the private army of the president being used for highly dubious, virtually invariably uh, disastrous interventions in other people's countries. Si el gobierno de Estados Unidos quiere diálogo, Venezuela siempre tendrá la puerta abierta. Pero somos un país libre. Bolívar dijo que el 30 de mayo fue en 1820 lanzó aquella frase. El impulso de esta revolución ya está dado. Nada podrá detenerla. Henry Ford said in the 20s, I pay my workers so they can buy my cars. Very simple formula. I pay my workers a good salary. Why? Because I want there to be demand for my cars, which worked. Mass era of everybody can have an automobile, everybody can have a decent level. And globalization destroys that. Because when you can go cross boundary, you can find somebody to produce those cars, not at all at the wages that Henry Ford was prepared to pay. The defenses are going to solve the problem, and immigration laws aren't going to solve the problem. The problem is solved not with band-aids like those, but by going to the root cause.